Okay, so there's a lot of words on this page. Let me just point out some important parts. The sum of two vectors is called vector addition. And whenever you do add two together, you get a resultant vector. So those are a couple of important words that you need to know. And this first sentence right here, to find u plus v, we first draw the vector u, so draw the first one, from where it stops, from the terminal end of u, we draw the vector v. Okay, so let's try that before we do anything else. So I want to draw a picture so you can see what's happening. Then I'll show you the math behind it. So we draw the vector u, which is 3, negative 2. Okay, we draw this vector. This is where it stops. From here, we draw the vector v. So from here we go negative 1, 4. Our resultant vector is this one. Okay, so how do we calculate that vector? So this was our u, this was our v, and this is our answer, our resultant vector. Okay, so to get u plus v, we add the x's, we add the y's, or rather, we add the a's, we add the b's. So we have 3 plus negative 1 and negative 2 plus 4. So we end up with 2, 2. And you can see that that is exactly what we got. This is 2, 2 right here. Now what if we wanted to subtract them? So u minus v it's the same thing as saying u plus negative v, right? So what we could do is add 3, negative 2, and the opposite of v. So add this one and this one. It's like distributing the negative throughout the second vector. So add the a's, add the b's we end up with 4, negative 6. So let's draw a picture and see what this looks like. We had 3, negative 2, and then we want to add the opposite of this one. So if we add the opposite of that one, that would be 1, negative 4. The resultant vector is this one, so 4, negative 6.